quickly get into today's trending stories. It's time for our hot topics brought to you by an officer and a gentleman at the Walton Arts Center. Now the countdown to the new year officially on. Okay. 2022 numerals cool. have arrived in oh. Times Square with less than a week to go before the highly anticipated December 31st New Year's Eve celebration. I, here's something I didn't know. The Coast to Coast journey brought the numerals through Nevada, Michigan, Pennsylvania, Virginia, and Maryland. Wow. The four numerals use a total of 599 energy sufficient LED bulbs. I mean, what's one more bulb to even it out to I 600? That's exactly what I was going to comment <laughs> about. Let's get up to 600, yeah, 599. Come on. Maybe next year we get a three in there, right? Yeah, so yeah. that'll happen. Okay. Well, Chris Noth will no longer be a part of the series The Equalizer in the wake of sexual assault allegations against the actor. Noth has played a former CIA director on The Equalizer, which does star Queen Latifah. Two women accused Noth of sexual assault. He vehemently denied the allegations, which date back to 2004 and 2015. Sex in the City series star Sarah Jessica Parker, Cynthia Nixon, and Kristen Davis issued a joint statement on social media saying they were saddened by the allegations against Noth, but supported his accusers. There's just more details to this every day, there every day. I have not watched it unfolding. just like that. I'm probably the only person that has not watched it yet. Right. Um, no, this, you're not. I haven't watched okay, it. Okay, okay, so the duo, the duo of us. <laughs> but um, yeah, I'm keeping an eye on this one. Yeah.